Okay, hello YouTube, it's me, Sean. Um, I am making a video, I just did a video. Oh, it looks kind of dark, just a second. Um, okay, that didn't work. <laughs> um, never mind my little chunky arm there. Um, <laughs> just kidding. Um, okay, so... I'm doing the video. Oh, I know what. Yeah, that's better. Okay. Okay, I'm doing a video because um, I realized that I miscalculated my weeks. And um, they changed. I'm not due on the 11th anymore, January 11th. I'm due on the 14th. So, um, so yeah. So, I'm like, actually, technically according to my due date I'm 13 weeks and five yeah five days 14 weeks and, or 13 weeks and five days and um, um, but if you go by how I'm measuring the ultrasound it shows how I've been calculating which means I'm 14 weeks in a day today's Wednesday yeah so I'm 14 weeks in one day but I don't know. All I know is I'm cramping. I'm stretching. <laughs> I'm swollen. Not just my belly, but like my left leg is swollen at the bottom. Um, my calf is swollen. And I don't know. I just, I just watched another video um, where uh, the lady was, another lady, she's pregnant and she was talking about sodium. And you know, I had cereal this morning. But I guess sodium is something to watch out for. Which I, I didn't. Nobody ever told me that. But, yeah, so I'm swollen on, on one leg. So I'm trying to keep it elevated. I kept it elevated, but now it just, well, it's not aching anymore. But it was aching. Sorry, Trey. That's my dog. But, um, it was aching. And so now it's okay. But, I don't know. That's just kind of weird. I just hope it doesn't get any bigger. Or you know cause me problems later because my wedding is in 10 days so yeah definitely don't want any issues like like I don't want any issues so and plus my vacation is after the wedding the week after the wedding so um so yeah not trying to have any complications oh, excuse me but yeah lately here um, especially yesterday, they say, okay, when you get round ligament pain, they say it's from, it's because you're stretching, like your uterus is growing, your skin is stretching and everything, you know, it's starting to, you're going to, um, it's making room, but my thing is, like, and they also say, like, to, to leave it or whatever, like, relieve it, just, like, whatever you're doing, maybe you're doing too much, you know, just, prop your feet up and relax well this happens when I when I am relaxed so I don't have any option I don't know what to do but it doesn't hurt I just get I mean it doesn't last long but it's like little cramps not like period cramps but just like little cramps little shooting pains just little and it's like I don't know just kind of not cool and um but yeah and then today like oh my gosh like smells I was okay with you know I used to I'm a nursing assistant well I was, I was working as a nursing assistant but since I had a rocky first couple weeks um um couple weeks in my pregnancy like maybe the first between week between the time I found out and week nine I think yeah week nine is when I got put on all the um the bed rest and all that and when I eventually got off work um which I'm filling out for leave absence but I'm a nursing assistant so I've seen it all I've smelt it all like anything I'm okay I was okay with smells you know sights seeing things kind of like got me a little bit but smells I was cool well guys I'm like 13 14 weeks whatever and um my fiance he cooked the other day and he didn't wash his dishes 
And sorry, Mikey, but I'm not putting you on blast. I'm just giving an example because he's subscribed to my YouTube. But, um, yeah, so I was going to wash the dishes because he, you know, he's working 16 hours today and he's going to be a good little wife to be because, you know, since he is working, I was going to try to clean and everything. Well, I go to start the water and get the dishes in there and the smell didn't bother me. I smelt it. It was okay. Okay. So then I'm on the phone with my sister, so I come into the living room, sitting in the living room, talking to her on the phone, and I'm like, um, yeah, so I go back in the kitchen to wash the dishes, because I had cooked fish the night before for today, and I was going to finish my meal, like, make macaroni and cheese and, um, and vegetables today with my fish, and so I had to, I had to wash the dishes in order to do that, and I just, I went in there on empty stomach and oh my god like it just made me want to just I was like you know how you get that burping effect in your mouth or whatever where you feel like you're about to gag or whatever um that's the that's what I felt and even talking about it makes me feel queasy and all that great stuff so I'm about to switch the subject um but yeah so smells are starting to get to me now oh <sighs> lord um, and I'm getting out of breath more and more each day. But anyways, I also sleep weird. <laughs> I'll sleep diagonal in this hot second, but it's comfortable. Oh my gosh. Like, I'm, I sleep on my back now because I'm a stomach sleeper, but since the I'm getting a little bigger and it's starting to bother me more and more to sleep on my stomach, I'll try to go side to side. But if my fiance is not there, because, you know, I'll kind of lay on my side like this and he's on his side so I'll like hold on to him and I'll stay on my side but if he's not there I'm on my back I try side to side I might even try to stomach for a little laying on my stomach for a little bit but it's so uncomfortable like it's just better lay on my back and I know that's not going to be happening for long so I'm trying to get used to the side to side but it's just not happening right now um um, what else? Um, I do have a little energy back. I've been sleeping a lot more lately. Um, probably because I don't sleep well at night. And, um, let's see. What else? Um, I don't know. I do try to do a little something, something here and there. But lately, I just, I don't know. We got stairs and, I don't know. I, maybe I'm just lazy like since I've been pregnant or found out that I was pregnant maybe so but I'll get I don't know after this wedding I'll be okay I figure I'm gonna get the house before the baby come the house will be in tip-top condition like seriously but um yeah as of right now room by room day by day um or trying to anyways so but yeah um other than that, it's, I don't know, I have my headache, I haven't had a headache all week today, all week, so I'm really excited about that, no headache so far, um, knock on wood, and, um, what else, I don't know, I can't drink tea anymore, you know that Arizona, um, honey and ginseng tea, which I have right here. I can't drink that no more. I guess the kid doesn't like it <laughs> or something. I don't know. My body's rejecting it. And that's my favorite, like, tea drink. It's so good. Um, but, yeah, can't have it. At least not for the moment anyway. It's, it messes my stomach up. Um, but, yeah, other than feeling uncomfortable and swelling and gaining weight and eating, that's another thing. Oh, my goodness. I can just eat and then, like set my food down or put my, throw my plate away and have like this in, like this need to just eat like I'm not need like I'm not hungry I like I'm I get hungry and it's like oh I gotta eat I gotta eat I gotta eat um but I, I sometimes I don't eat right after I I eat a meal I try not to because yeah but I get so hungry and if I don't eat like I'm finding out that once I eat and I'm hungry right after that if I don't eat, then I get even more hungrier, and then it can affect me later. But anyhow, I just wanted to give another little, um, not an update, but just explaining my symptoms and or things that I forgot. 
But my time is drawing near, so I will talk to you guys later.